What would happen if we believed that every life was worth fighting for? That instead of seeing statistics, we would see the heartbeats and voices and laughter and people with breath and their lungs just like everyone else. But if we finally took a moment to look at our world, see the pain and the suffering, and instead of turning away, we did something about it. We could love people well and fight for the justice of remembering that everyone has a story, has a dream, has a desire to be something more than their circumstances allow them to be. Every person is valuable. Every person worth loving, worth holding, worth keeping safe from a fate no one was meant to face. What would happen if we believed that every life was worth fighting for? Good evening, everyone. Uh, I'm Matt Marr, and just wanted to share a little bit of my heart about uh, this night and the season that we find ourselves in. There's a fancy Latin word which has hung around for centuries called Advent, and Advent marks the four weeks before Christmas. And when I made my newest project, The Advent of Christmas, I realized that Advent also means arrival, and the process of God arriving isn't something that just happened overnight. It was a promise that took hundreds and hundreds of years to uh, manifest into fulfillment. And I think in some ways, every year as Christmas approaches, we can kind of re-enter into that sense of expectation of uh, wanting God to show up in a major way in our life and making room, making space uh, for Him to do so. So my prayer and my hope for you tonight is as we sing and pray these songs that uh, God gives you a vision of how you and your family could prepare to celebrate his birth in a more meaningful way. Oh, come, oh, come, me And ransom captive Israel That mourns in lonely exile here Until the Son of God appear Rejoice, rejoice, Emmanuel Shall come to to the Hey! 
Through the snow in a one horse open sleigh. Oh, the fields we go, laughing all the way. Bells on pop tails ring, making spirits bright. What fun it is to ride and sing, saying songs tonight. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride. Open sleigh. Hey, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Get up now.
The Advent of Christmas by Matt Marr. All is merry and all is bright. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Four weeks to slow down in the hustle and bustle. The advent of Christmas is here. To mark the passing of the time, a wreath of evergreen, its leaves show us God's infinite love, what Christmas really means. Upon the wreath, five candles sit, three purple, one pink, and one white. The purple for fasting, the pink for rejoicing, the white for a long Christmas night. First Sunday, first Sunday, is it Christmas already? Hold on, there's four weeks yet to come. More than Santa and presents, we're waiting for Jesus with hope for everyone. We light the second candle for peace and remember the prophets of old. Filled with God's glory, they start up our story, prepare the way of the Lord. This third joyful Sunday is pink for a party. Gaudete is a word for rejoice. Do not be afraid. His love is strong. Lift up your heart and your voice. The fourth week we hear of God's love for all and the favor and promise to be. When Gabriel spoke and Mary declared, let it be done unto me. Four weeks have passed and now a white candle shines as bright as an evening star to lead the way for three wise kings who traveled from afar. And this is what all the waiting is for, to lead us where Christmas begins, a tale of a family in Bethlehem with no room at the inn. Joseph and Mary had made their way there while she had a baby inside. They had no place to lay their heads, no home for their special child. Yet on that night, the Christ was born and wrapped in swaddling clothes. Our humble Savior was laid in a manger, a sign like the angel foretold. The shepherds came, the animals came, as angel choirs were singing, where love came down to make amends while the world was sleeping. Glory to God in the highest place. Hallelujah, our Savior is here. Merry Christmas to all from heaven to earth, and to all a happy new year. The End Breaking the silence into the chaos you came. Born in our likeness, held in the hands that you made. For our deliverance, your promise was given a name. Emmanuel. Look up. Reputation we took on our flesh and blood for our forgiveness and for the world you so love. Emmanuel, the God is saved. Angel.
angels adore Bow down before Glory to God with us Christmas was born Your kingdom come Glory to God with us Angels adore Bow down before Glory to God Emmanuel The God is saved I hear a voice Heaven declare Prepare the way Christmas was born on that day, oh what a day, oh what a day. This next song is a really meaningful song for me. Uh, and uh, it is sort of all about the, the expectation and the promise and the hope of Jesus coming into the world that he has for the whole human race. And I think that's one of the things that makes the season of Advent and Christmas so amazing is um, the hope of Jesus is a hope that's built for everyone and it's meant to be shared with everyone. And I think particularly during the Christmas season, when we consider the fact that God himself took on flesh and became the most vulnerable, in some ways it reveals his heart for the most vulnerable. And one of the, I think, situations in our world in which people have their hopes stolen from them is in the reality of human trafficking. And sometimes when we think about an issue like that, it feels so unbelievably daunting that we don't even know where to start. We don't even know how to solve it. 
And I want to talk to you about um, an organization that's doing amazing work, that's stopping human trafficking before it starts, that's working with kids to make sure that they're safe, that they can become difference makers uh, in their communities, that they're cared and loved for and seen and valued and cherished as a child of God. And that organization is called Love Justice International. And for little as $10 a month, you can help their efforts to stop human trafficking before it even starts. So as I'm singing this next song, I just want to invite you to pray it, to sing it with me, and to ask God, hey, do you want me to come alongside and help these people, help the most uh, valuable work that they're doing in stopping human trafficking? This song's called Hope for Everyone. Hear the angels sing, there's hope for everyone. To one down, king, there's hope for everyone. What good news they bring, there's hope for everyone. Angels sing, there's hope for everyone. They came from the fall. Wise men saw the star, there's hope for everyone. Shepherds heard the choir, there's hope for everyone. From afar, there's hope for everyone. And we are waiting on the promise for the one who lights the dark.
the first Noel the angels did say was to certain poor shepherds in fields as they lay in fields where they lay keeping their sheep on a cold winter's night that was so deep no the king.